Right, how much should you exercise? I'm gonna walk, because I think it looks a bit jolty. But uh, I get asked a lot, how often should you exercise? Right. The best way to understand it is if you think about it like work, you know, so people, every, a lot of people work different patterns. So some people do split shifts, so they do four hours in the morning and four hours in the evening. Some people do just uh, early morning, so they start at six, finish at two, just consistently. Some people just do like daytime, uh, eight hours. Some people do like three 12 hour shifts, but each one of them normally ends up with the same kind of wage by the end of it. The frequency is just different of how they work. With exercise, it's the same, you know. You can work out a little bit every single day and you'll be healthy. You could work out um, more intensely and then do it a few times a week and the outcome be similar. And uh, so like, for example, right now, this week I haven't worked out as much as I should have. So this morning I've got up and I've done a longer run than I normally would uh, to compensate, I need to walk, uh, compensate for what I haven't done within the week. So the frequency is pretty much up to you. The intensity determines that. Hold on a second. So if you're only gonna work out a couple of times a week, those two workouts need to be highly intense, well not highly intense, but they need to be longer or highly intense to be able to compensate for what you haven't done. If you can work out every single day, then obviously the uh, intensity doesn't need to be as high and the sessions don't need to be as long. Uh, now, Personally, I think getting into the routine of working out every single day is the greatest way because when you do work out, most of you know, you're released endorphins, so it's pumping chemicals within your body. So every single day you're having those chemicals pumped within your body, which helps within the day. And then there's so much with exercise. And so like when you exercise, um, particularly in the morning, when you go to sleep, you know, your brain fills up with stuff. It acts like a recycle bin and it gets rid of all that stuff through exercising. It helps push toxins out the body, you know, helps sweat a lot. It sweats, when it sweats, it sweats good and bad stuff. So um, just kind of refresh your body. But the, the frequency and how much you exercise is up to you. It's just the intensity will determine if you do, you know, it would be higher or lower depending if you do uh, more exercise and less exercising. So that's my little nugget for today. I'm gonna get back running. Speak to you soon.